<clears throat> All right, so there's load one of many. 12 minutes since I set the camera up. Could get more on there, but really this trailer is not rated for all that much. The tires are starting to squat just a little bit now. This stuff's pretty heavy because it's wet. But what's funny, you know, I, I don't condone how this guy keeps his livestock at all. But if it benefits me and my family to be able to come in here and get this manure for garden soil, you know what? Let him do it. So I'm scraping it all the way down. You see that white right in there? That's the original, original grade level, the original soil. I shoveled a whole bunch out of here a couple of months ago and I piled it all up out there outside the, the fence just so I could come in and get it faster later. I had to touch it twice, but I mean, I didn't have to come in and open the gate and deal with it if it was real nasty in here because this will get just, I mean, like a soup. But what's interesting mentioning the soup is the fact that I had all this shoveled out down to that base soil and there was a higher hill elsewhere. So just it getting wet and the cows mucking around in it has caused all this to flow back in and settle in. So uh, it's actually scooping out a lot easier right now because it's wet. Once it gets dry and it packs, it's, it's kind of hard to break up. So right now it's actually a little gooey. Um, so I'm trying to take advantage of that. Even I'm gonna try to get as many loads as I can today on the trailer, but on top of that, I might stockpile more outside the fence here just to try to help clean out more and more of this. Because again, he's told me, take all you want he sees it as a problem so take it you can have it i don't want it and i'm sitting there going i absolutely want it <laughs> it's excellent garden soil so yeah it's a good agreement at some point if i ever get my dump truck back i plan to come in here and bring him some loads of actual clay so that he can build up a hill in here to feed on that actually stays dry because i hate seeing his cattle walk around in in mucky wet conditions but at the end of the day that's his problem not mine um, so yeah, just trying to take what I can where I can. Anyway, let's get this over to the house, get it dumped off, and then see if we can come back and get some more. Second load, sweet. Sliding out good, not sticking in the trailer like last night. I'm gonna put as many in here as I can, just dumping them flat. Um, and then I'll have to get the tractor back over here and actually shovel them up into a pile. Cause this trailer, the way it dumps, it spreads out these long, low piles. So I have to get the trailer, the tractor back over here once we're done hauling and kind of consolidate it all up into a bigger pile. So let's go back for more, woo -hoo! And we'll try to talk over the train here, but this is it. It's load number four on the day. I got my stockpile outside the fence cleaned up at least, which is something I just wanted to get done in case he needs to park a trailer or something here. You know, his property's real thin. That's his fence line over there with my property line, and then this is his other property line. So he doesn't hardly have space to put anything in here. Um, so he parks all these trailers beside his driveway. Uh, anyway, so I got that cleaned up, and I got, yeah, three loads out of this muck. Right there, that last load coming out, I got a soft spot just like my property right there it's rotten if I step in that it's squishy like a marshmallow but it'll set up it'll be okay but yeah there's uh 
tons and tons more that could come out of there. It's amazing that I shoveled it out six months ago and it's like it never happened. So there's plenty more to take, plenty more to have. I'll have to come back for more, but let me get this brought over to the house, dumped out, and uh, then I'll show you my big stock pile that I'm proud of. All right, well, I promised to show you my pile of loot here, and I'm not saying this is all of it, because I might go back for more yet, depending on how much I need. But, yeah, that's uh, it's a pretty healthy pile when you got the little tractor there, pile of manure here. And you can see, of course, I've talked about this a million times, but these daggum strings all in it and just trash. I don't know why this guy has to be as trashy as he is, but... You know, it just comes with the territory. You know, I want to have this good good garden soil. I don't know what that is. It looks like a, it almost looks like one of those stinging nettles, but it looks like way overgrown compared to what I usually see. Probably like all jacked up on roids because this is such amazing soil. Anyway, just wanted to show that off. 